Good morning, guys. As you can tell by the title of the video, we've got a very special episode planned for y'all. So, I'm not gonna waste y'all's time, honestly. I'm just gonna head right into it because I'm super excited. Gotta go get breakfast, and then I've gotta make a 40 minute drive to meet up with my dad and Shay to go fishing for the day and to show y'all this huge surprise. Guys, that is it. I can't believe what has happened over the past week, but when my dad and I went to go uh, buy a boat and Shay was with us, we happened to uh, just go at the perfect right time. We went to Fun, Fun and Sun, and um, because as y'all know, if y'all are into fishing, watch the channels, Guggen Squad, they highly recommended them, talked about how great of a company it is. So we decided to go there because we thought it was you know, good people, good environment, good deals. And the guy, he took us to the back and he said, a boat just happened to come in. If y'all want to take it, uh, check it out. And we did, and the instant I saw the boat, I recognized exactly whose boat it was because of the stickers on the front dash, which I will show you in a second. But man, guys, I can't believe what is happening and what we got. And that is Lake Fort Guy's boat. It's, it's still really surreal to even think about because it's like, you know, he got this boat a year ago and I would have never thought in a year from then that we would have his boat, you know? And he took such great care of it, which is awesome. And he was out doing a whole bunch of other stuff, so he didn't use it a whole bunch. There was like 43 hours on the engine and it was a heck of a deal. And I'm excited to go catch some Mondos off of it. And hopefully we can continue the tradition of the silver bullet and uh, try and catch some big ones. Maybe some 10 plus pounders. And this year, I think we can do it. Honestly, I really do. We're gonna, we got a bunch of big plans, ready to go and uh, fish a whole bunch of places. And uh, I'm excited. So we're just gonna get right into this video. fish so hopefully we can do that the water is a little little murky to say the least so it's probably gonna be a black and blue type it's of day it's perfect yeah okay sure water's perfect i like clear water fishing <clears throat> water's perfect whose boat are we on we are on lake fort guys boat which is pretty cool not gonna lie <laughs> yeah definitely literally like the last person who drove this boat what was him it was justin yeah lfg Cruising on Silver Bullet. Jay's just doing his thing. <laughs> Are we not videotaping eating? Why? Making us all conscious. <laughs> my dad has a fish. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Shay, watch my rod. Bring it up over here, Dad. Bring it up. Oh, you got it. You got it. What a freaking monster. That is awesome. Uh, What'd you catch them on? Uh, a blue and black jig. Man. Caught the first bass ever on the silver bullet, guys. See? Dad caught it right on the black and blue jig. Oh yeah. Show up the camera. It's 
great one. Kind of skinny, but it's about 51 degrees. That's a beautiful fish, though. All right, you want to let it go? Let me take a picture. This is for LFG, the silver boat. Silver, the silver boat. boat. The adventures of the silver bullet continue. <sighs> Thank you, LFG. We appreciate it. Put it back in there. See you later. Thank you. Oh, you remember Parker, right? From Montana? Yeah. He cut off his hair. I didn't know that. Follow him on Instagram. Shay, let's update us. Man, it's been day. rough. Uh, really rough. Uh, we caught one fish so far. Uh, I didn't catch it, so it doesn't really matter. Um, we had a few more bites, but other than that, pretty slow. Um, we're going to go run over here to the dam and then call it a day. It's getting pretty cold, too. So, yeah. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video. It's a short little video here. Uh, basically what had happened is crazy how we even got a hold of this uh, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you all the story behind of it essentially we were going to go and just go and get a boat and we decided to go fun on uh, fun and sun um, because there's a good dealership near us and we get there we were had our eyes set on like this boat they were selling that was purple and black and white and it was a pretty cool boat and the guy the salesperson he decided to take us in the back he said hey we just had a new boat um, come in literally a couple days ago and he took us to the back there and he says they're still cleaning it up and I look and by looking at the stickers on the front of the dash I instantly knew whose boat it was I was like yeah that's definitely the boat and um, luckily we were able uh, to get a hold of the boat we said no one um, had seen it yet and they you know were about to put it on the market and that we had first rights to it if we wanted it and so we definitely said yes after looking at some other boats uh, for about another hour and a super awesome video i know it was slow it was about the water temp was about 50 degrees and so the fishing was very very tough we caught one fish uh hooked onto a couple of others had some bites here and there but that was about it hopefully though especially with this season coming up we can continue on the legacy of lake fort guy and the silver bullet and we can definitely catch a couple of big mondos we have some plans during spring break uh, to be doing some fishing around East Texas um, and you know all over Texas and so hopefully we can hook on to some big ones there and w if this weather can clear up here in Texas and stop being so weird and cold uh, hopefully the fish will move up um, for spawn and uh, we can we can try and pin them down and catch some catch some big female bass but once again I hope you all enjoyed this episode make sure to stay tuned to see more of the Silver Bullet, Real Huntsman, signing out.